Ihi po ako ng ihi at mabula po ang ihi ko. Normal lang po ba ang varicocele sa right side? Okay lang po kaya ang parang gawin maintenance yung spirulina? I mean every day. Ito take ko siya for the rest of the life. Hello and welcome to this channel. Ako po ang inyong friendly urologist na si Dr. Joseph Lee. Ilan sa inyong katanungan na ipinadula sa akin, sa akin ha, ay sasagutin ko na ngayon. Dahil dito sa aking channel, tanong nyo, sagot ko. Mula kay Eddie Lanceta. Good day po. Good day rin sa iyo. Ihi po ako ng ihi at mabula po ang ihi ko. Masakit din po ang balakang ko. May CKD or chronic kidney disease po ako at may mga gamot na iniinom. Ah, meron ka na palang problem sa kidney before. Meron po bang ibang gamot na pwedeng inumin para dito? Alright. Ang chronic kidney disease is secondary to renal parenchymal diffuse parenchymal disease na through the, the years nasisira ang mga tubules because of infection destruction of the, the kidney for certain disease or metabolic diseases like diabetes, diba? yung mga hypertensive no, type of disease that they are that are taking a lot of medication, pwede rin yun, no? Congenital that have converted to chronic kidney disease, diba? Mga congenital diseases, no? Then, other than that, ano eh, more or less infection and inflammation that cause the destruction of the renal tubules, no? May gagamot. Initially, kung maganda ang pag-follow up mo, pwede. Pwede masalba ang kidney. But if it continues to deteriorate, wala tayo magagawa, then you'll end up to have dialysis. Nagbubulang ihi could be secondary to high concentration of the urine. It could be secondary to high pH because you have chronic kidney disease. So, madalas makikita mo. Or it could be secondary to high protein concentration, no? Di ba? In the urine. So, maraming waiting nating pag-isipan dyan. So, anong dapat nating gawin? We can do a urinalysis error and ultrasound, okay? Mula kay Eza Fiesta. Hello po, Doc. Normal lang po ba ang varicocele sa right side? In reference kasi, varicocele is the defect of your testicular vessels no? on whichever sides, no? either unilateral or bilateral. You have to correct it for fertility purpose because it can hamper spermatogenesis. No? So what we do is we just have to do a surgical intervention on the defective testicular vessels, no? Mula kay Metosnas. Doc, may question po ako. Okay lang po kaya ang parang gawin maintenance yung spirulina? Yes. I mean every day. Yes. No? It take course, yeah, for the rest of the life. Mas yes, mas okay yan because you, you protect the, the normal cells, improve your immune system, and Likewise, you protect your your body from invasion of bacteria and viral and even fungal infection. Okay? At yan ang sagot sa inyong mga katanungan. Huwag kalimutan mag-subscribe at i-click ang notification bell. Post your questions in the comment box below. Dahil dito sa aking channel, tanong nyo, sagot ko. Muli ako po ang inyong friendly urologist na si Dr. Joseph D. Saying hello but never goodbye. Thank you for watching.